In this demonstration, we further examine Locard's principles and there's, there's some type of transfer going on. What you're gonna need is two pieces of um, sandpaper from your dad's workspace. And uh, this is an actual uh, wool sock. If you have two different colors of that wool so sock or piece of felt in a different color, it'll further demonstrate, again, uh, what we're trying to uh, examine here. And this is a very, very brief experiment, but on that sandpaper, we're going to rub some of that sock onto the coarse piece of sandpaper. And we're gonna do the same <clears throat> for this piece of felt. And obviously you can see that there's two different types of fibers there. And now what we're gonna do is transfer. So there was a transfer going on there. So although you can't see it on here, but I can guarantee if you took a look at a microscope, you can see that there were some sandpaper particles left on each of those, um, each of those items, each of those pieces of fabric. Again, we don't have a microscope, so uh, that's gonna be hard to tell. So what we're basically gonna be doing is transferring one to the other. So without touching the green piece of felt or the black wool sock, there was a transfer going on from uh, one piece of sandpaper to the other. So that's a fairly easy and very quick experiment that you can do at home saying that there's a transfer, a Locar's principle, there's a transfer, an exchange going on without even touching the actual material that is being transferred. So again, we talked about Ignaz Simowis and his hand washing theories and what's in practice today in the medical field. And this is exactly one of the reasons why we do the hand washing so that transfer does not go around. You do not have, if these two items are contaminants, you don't necessarily have to touch those contaminants to be contaminated. And that's what we're combating right now with this crisis. Hope you learned something. We'll see you next lab.